Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are going to be talking about the Orly Neon Earth Collection for summer 2018. It is blowing my mind that there's already summer collections out. This is crazy. Uh, and we're going to talk about Orly. If you guys want to see my thoughts and some swatches, well if you want to hear my thoughts and see some swatches, just keep watching. This is a six piece collection from Orly and it is called Neon Earth. When I first saw the promo shots for this, I was honestly a little annoyed because I thought, are you kidding me? This is a collection of reds. Are you joking? And then when I got the polishes and the, the polishes look uh, much different than the promo pictures and they always do and I, I shouldn't have gotten annoyed by that. But the polishes look much different than the, uh, the promo shots I saw and I was much happier with how it looked. The first polish is called Desert Rose, and this is a really beautiful rose cream. This has a fantastic formula. If you have perfect nails and you have no ridges in your nails, uh, this was going to cover in one coat. I did two coats because my nails are not perfect, but if you have no ridges in your nails, if you just have perfectly smooth nails, this is going to cover in one coat. It has an amazing formula. It like it was a joy to work with which is really dramatic to talk about a polish that way but it was pretty nice and I love this sort of rose color because I think this is still like I still consider this a bright color but it's not a neon but it's not a dull color I still think that this is really pretty and a nice summer color The next one is called Blazing Sunset, and if you can see how electric this looks, that is how it looks. It is eye-searingly bright, and this one covers, again, in two coats, but if you have smooth nails, no ridges, no imperfections, nothing that needs to be buffed, or you know, no imperfections in your nails, this is going to cover it in one coat. Another amazing formula on this one. I almost just left this on one coat, but there was one or two tiny dark areas that I I needed to cover. But that was my nails. If you have nice nails, one coat. No white base, one coat. Super bright. Awesome. The next one is called Afterglow, and this is a neon peach cream. This one covered in two coats. It might have been what I would call a little bit thin. Not bad. It didn't, you know, bleed all over my nails, but it was a little bit thinner than some of the other oily polishes that I've used. Still a good formula, but just a little bit thinner. Um, still covered in two coats. This one is called Sands of Time, and this is a peach cream. This one, because it's a lighter color, it covers in two to three coats. I keep saying this, but I usually do three coats on my index and ring finger because they have ridges on them, so they need an extra coat. Um, otherwise, this had a really nice formula, so you, you might need two to three coats depending on the shape of your nails. Not shape, depending on the condition of your nails. Next, we have Moon Dust. Um, this is this champagne frosty color. I'm not really sure why we keep getting this color in Orly. China Glaze has done a lot of these. I don't really uh, get why we keep getting this color. I don't like this color. I don't like... The formula is fine. It covers in two coats, but it's just very frosty and it leaves brush strokes. And for me personally, I just do not like this color, but... It had a nice formula, I just, I don't need any more of that color. I have like four from Morley. Dramatic, Amanda. Lastly, we have Valley of Fire. This is a beautiful molten bronze shimmer. This one covers in two coats. It has a really great formula for as, I guess, 
disappointed as I was in the color scheme the formulas on these polishes made up for because they were incredibly easy to work with they applied very nicely and even this guy that was a little bit thin it wasn't thin in a bad way it was just thinner than some of the other polishes still very easy to work with and this was no different and I love this color I actually really love these two colors together I think that's nifty So that's the Orly Neon Earth collection. What did you guys think of this collection? Are you going to be picking any of these up? Let me know your favorite from this collection. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And if you have any questions or comments or video suggestions, leave those down below. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video.